What is good all you doggies in the hood of Young Spunks here, back with another video. I know, it's been a while, but I've been training hard, I've been skating hard, five days a week, workouts, skates in the morning, I've been busy, so I've been tired when I get back, but I'm here, I'm back at it. Hey Google, pause. Oh, there you go. Anyways, today, uh, you know, I'm just going with the flow, I just got back, I'm gonna make some chicken right now. I got some chicken here that I'm gonna cook up quick. Uh, I'm boiling some rice in here, so um, I'm gonna get this done. I'm gonna cook it. I gotta eat. I haven't eaten yet today, and it is currently 1:20. Then we'll get on with the day. Enjoy. Chicken's cooking. Rice is uh, now steaming up. Okay, I don't normally cook chicken that much. Gonna be honest with you. When I eat chicken, I usually buy it because I'm nervous I won't cook it enough. But this actually looks pretty good. A little bit of teriyaki sauce in there. Not a bad, not a bad mixture. And the rice, obviously, that's not difficult to cook, so. All right, it is finished. And there it is. Not a bad finished product. Just literally rice and chicken, carbs and protein. I'm gonna muck this and then we'll get after the rest of the video. Oh, all right. So I just finished eating and I'm really tired. This is about the time where I take a nap because I was at the rink for about three or four hours. I'm reading a book right now. So we're gonna read until I fall asleep, nap for about 30 to 40 minutes. And then I'm actually gonna go through my morning routine because I found a kind of consistent thing that I do that I think is really helpful for you guys if you want to get into it. So yeah, see you when I wake up. Okay, I just woke up from my nap, so what better time to do a good morning routine? Uh, first things first, I gotta get dressed. There we go, um, next thing. So there are three main things that I do when I wake up in the morning that I think are very, very helpful to start my day. First thing I do when I wake up, very first thing is I fix my bed. So we're gonna do that right now. See, I don't just fix it half ass. I fix it perfect so that it looks nice, it looks good. And the reason why is because it gives me a sense of organization, of accomplishment. So my first accomplishment of the day, even though it's easy, was fixing my bed and it feels as though like now I can do more things throughout my day, I feel good. I feel like I start off my morning right. Like, I mean, look at how, I'm a clean freak. Like, look at how perfectly clean the bed is, right? It's perfect. First thing of the day, we're started off right. Okay, and obviously, yeah, I gotta brush my teeth. I gotta do those things. Those are included in this as well, but I'm talking about the three most important things to start off my day right. And the next thing is journal writing. I have a journal. I have a journal right here. This is it. It says, precisely, it says, don't wait. The time will never be just right. I'm not gonna show you what's in here because what's in here is my stuff and it's my personal thing, but I write goals for the day. I write things that I wanna accomplish, um, mental health stuff positive things. Honestly, this journal consists of random stuff. If I wake up feeling really good about my my day, then I make some goals and uh, I set some a plan out to get better for that day. If I don't feel very energetic, I try and motivate myself and write down my goals once again and I write down past accomplishments that I've done. Um, I thank God for everything I have. I write down things that I'm thankful for. So this is a lot more than just a book. It's important. Um, it sets off my day right. It makes me dialed in, uh, if you will. And now, the final thing that I do every single morning, and I've been doing this for a long time. I did it throughout college. Sorry about the lighting. I did it throughout college too, but especially recently, throughout the last year is I get a glass of water and I put a thousand milligram emergency in it, stir it up, 
and drink it. That is a very, very crucial part of my morning. And the reason why is one, I get hydrated, so I don't take the pill. I take the mix because I'll force myself to have a full glass of water, which is really good in the morning because you lose a lot of water throughout the night. So I'm gonna go to the gym after, you know, with a good start to my hydration. And the second reason is because of COVID and everything. And even if COVID isn't a thing, I did this before COVID too, being sick, sucks but what you can control is how long you're sick for and if that sickness stays so like if you get a cold but you have a lot of vitamin c in your system daily you know it's gonna be a lot easier to fight off that cold and when you're an athlete or if you have work to do throughout the week you have to go to the to your office to do work or you have to go to the gym or you want to go out on the weekends being sick sucks so having a lot of vitamin c to help you the best you can uh to give yourself that ability to hopefully recover faster, why not do it, right? Why not take a packet of vitamin C every morning? So those are the three main things in my day, okay, in my morning that I do that when I'm finished, I wake up about an hour earlier before I have to leave the house. When I'm finished, it feels great. And I start off my morning right, and I feel like I can build off of that. And fixing your bed is very important. Writing in your journal, is very very important and then taking vitamin c is just you know something else that goes out there i actually so i know a lot of you are probably wondering like do i eat breakfast no i don't have any breakfast in the morning i don't like working out on that and on that full stomach so i literally go to the gym i work out i skate i just hydrate have a protein shake after shout out to steve-o uh he makes his protein shake and then I'll come back and I'll make my food, I'll make lunch, that's what you just saw me eating before. Morning routines, they're important. Everybody has their own routine. My suggestion for you is to have something and stick to it every day so you feel organized in the morning and you feel like you can accomplish the whole day. Because as long as I do these things in the morning, I feel ready and I feel already organized for the rest of my day. I know that I can accomplish many more things. Um, so yeah, whatever your routine is, stick to it, stay true to it, tackle the day. That's been it guys, catch you in the next video, ciao.